Good morning to all my wonderful viewers out there. Welcome back to another episode of Drop List, the series where we cover all the items that are releasing in a specific week for various different brands. And in today's episode, we're going to be covering all the items that are releasing in week one of Palace's Ultimo 2020 collection. I'm so sorry, guys, that I have not uploaded in 24 hours. I know it's really weird to say because, like, there's a bunch of YouTubers that, like, upload once a month but for me not uploading within 24 to 48 hours is like a weird thing like it's like are you okay daniel you're all right why aren't you up uploading a lot of you guys have been commenting about yo you're covering this upcoming drop xyz yeah i know there is so much we have to cover for black friday today and i didn't cover any of it on thursday because i went out to uh, catch up with some fellas at a bar on Wednesday and I was too dusty on Thursday to do any videos and also obviously I'm working every day so my schedule has just been super busy and I have not been able to cover anything. Before we even dive into Palace Week 1 in this video today, I'm just going to quickly highlight some drops that are happening in the next 24 hours that you guys definitely should pay attention to. So just in the past like two hours, Warren Lotus released a new capsule of clothing. Uh, later on in, well, uh, it's going to be really hard with time zones, but in the next 24 hours, we're going to get a 30 pair collection of ASICS, uh, sorry, a 30 colorway collection of ASICS and Kith Gel Light 3s. We're going to get Girls Don't Cry X Human Made Fall Winter 2020 collection, which has an amazing varsity jacket in it. Obviously, we're going to have Supreme Week 14 because it was delayed because of Thanksgiving. And obviously, we're going to have Palace. Is there anything else? No, okay. That's just the next upcoming drops within the 24 hours. Uh, I also have like an unboxing video to do. I also have uh, episode 12 of the podcast. Dude, we have just got so much to cover. Um, oh God. We've got Del Schutze. We've got Del Schutze releasing an, um, a Black Friday drop. We've got so much. We've got so much. I'm going to try and cover Palace, obviously, in this video. Supreme in the next video. And then probably Del Schutze last. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get around Kith and, uh, you know, uh, Human Made. Like, I just don't think I can do it. I don't think I can do it, but I just thought I'd mention that to you guys. There is a lot dropping today for Black Friday. I should have covered it ages ago <laughs> but that's it so let's dive into it let's have a look at week one now week one this has been a little bit difficult to find a page uh that is covering the whole drop list hype beast hasn't posted about it alice drop hasn't posted about it the only place that i can find that has posted about week one's drop list is sln official whether or not they're going to have a very you know accurate first week drop list it's really up in the air, but it's the only place that we have to cover week one's drop list. So let's head on over there now and start covering week one of Palace's Ultimo 2020 collection. Here we are, guys. Now, if you guys are interested in reading this SLN article, it'll be linked down in the description section below. It was literally posted within like the last 24 hours. Like no one's got the information for week one. Uh, whether or not SLN here will have the most accurate drop list, it's honestly up in the air, but it's better than nothing. <laughs> like, it's better than nothing, nobody else has got the info, so yeah, uh, it's, it's definitely interesting, guys. So what we have here is the drop times. Friday the 27th, uh, for the UK and worldwide, it'll release on the Palace Web Store, 11 a.m. GMT time. For the US, it's going to release in-store and the Palace Web Store at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time or 8 a.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time. I assume that's your time zone for the same web store there. And obviously, if you live in Japan and China, it's uh, dropping on the Saturday there. So that is the drop times. That is the release details for you there, guys. And this is week one. Now, we have uh, obviously a lot of items. As, as we know, guys, week one is the biggest week that Palace does. So just looking at the week, there are a lot of pieces here that are going to be huge, huge highlights that people are going to be scrambling for. So one of the biggest motifs that is for this season is the chili duck out uh, motif. So it's a little duck chilling out with a palace pea and a little nightcap on. 
This features in a little toy, a gold pendant, which they release every season, a cap, a sweatshirt, and there's a pair of pants, and a pair of pants. So that motif is releasing this week. We're getting all that stuff this week. On top of that, we are getting the Tri Camo Hoodie. Palace posted that on their Instagram uh, page. They posted that the hoodie's coming out this week. We are getting the Tri Ferg Floor Mat. All of these items are gonna be very, very hot and hard to pick up items. This week, we are also getting the Shakespeare stuff. So we are getting the Varsity Jacket that was showcased to us in the lookbook. There's a lot of spe <coughs> speculation on how much it's going to cost. Some people are being very generous and saying, oh, it's going to be like around like 200 pounds, maybe 250. I don't know, man. Ever since they released a Whitney Houston varsity jacket, right? And that thing was like, what? It was like 350, 350 pounds. So I'm kind of in the middle. I'm like, look, I want to be generous and say this is releasing for low 200s. But I honestly feel like the minimum price this Varsity Jacket right here is going to release for is £300. Like, I, I just cannot see it releasing for 200 That's just way too low in that spectrum. Like, even if it was like 280 I just can't see it. 300 feels like the lowest price for me that it could go for. This week, on top of the Varsity Jacket, we are also getting things like the Christmas ornaments that are being released. So, Palace Carrier Bag Bauble, uh, Triferg Bauble. Uh, cherub bauble and the puffer bauble like we're getting them all we're getting them all this week we're also getting the uh vegan triferg tea that is the tea with uh the triferg bit of fruit on it and then it's just suitable for uh vegans on the bottom i thought that was pretty funny i thought it was a funny tea i mean i honestly wouldn't mind it i think it's a good laugh apparently we're getting the palaska t-shirt we're getting the suburban bliss ghost hood the uh we're getting all of the palace poor don pieces i don't know yeah it does showcase them here we're getting all of them this week there is a lot we're getting the bossy jacket there is just so much here in week one as i mentioned week one is the biggest week in the season and this week is really really good as you guys can see i'd love to know your thoughts and opinions on week one and all the items releasing i honestly don't even know what my favorite item is this week there's just so much like i want the chili duck sweatshirt i want the as you like it varsity jacket i want what else do i want i mean i wouldn't even mind the bossy jacket the one with the uh all over palace uh print all over it there's just so much there is so much to choose from here i want to hear from you guys down in that comment section below what are some items that you are looking to pick up from week one? I know I'm not really covering it in the normal way that we cover it, which is going through image by image of each item. But as I said, nobody else is reporting on it. So this is the best way that we can cover it. I want to hear from you guys. What is your favorite item? Are you going to be picking anything up this week? Let me know all your thoughts and opinions on week one of Palace's Ultimo 2020 collection down in that comment section below. And that is everything guys. That is all the items that are allegedly releasing. I don't know if SLN is probably the best source to use for information regarding Palace's drop list, but it's the only place that I could find that was going to tell me what the drop list was for week one of the Ultimo collection. There is so much good stuff here releasing in week one. For me, if I had to pick one piece that I had that I like that I was guaranteed to get, I'd probably go the Shakespeare Varsity Jacket in either of the colors because it's coming in a red and also a blue and yellow. Um, am I going to be going for any items this week? Not, no, I'm going to say no. Why am I not going for anything from week one? Well, because I want to try my luck with the Jordan 4s that are releasing, the Fire Red 4s, which I also forgot to mention <laughs> is releasing this week. But yeah, no, there are Fire Red 4s releasing this week. I want to give that a shot first. And then if I miss out on that, then I'll get a pity piece of clothing, you know? <laughs> I'll pick up a piece because I failed on the Fire Red 4s cop. But I would love to pick up some Palace pieces. But as I said, got to hold off for those Fire Red 4s. I want to know all your thoughts and opinions on week one, guys. And if you guys are going to be picking anything up down in that comment section below. 
Now, as I mentioned as well, guys, um, you know, if you want me to keep covering upcoming palace drops, upcoming palace releases, don't forget to leave a big old like on this video, a comment in the comment section down below, and a subscribe to the channel as we're trying to aim for a new milestone this month of 2,770 subscribers. We need literally less than 10 to hit that milestone, guys. So subscribe today, tell your mates, and hopefully with your support, we can hit that milestone before the end of November. Guys, that is it. Again, I want to just apologize for not uploading a lot over the past 48 hours and also just by using SLN for my uh, for covering week one. Unfortunately, there's just no other sources that have covered it. I would have loved to cover it the normal way that we cover it with the Hypebeast article, but you got to do what you got to do, I suppose. Yeah, so uh, let me know what your thoughts and opinions are on week one down in that comment section below, guys. And until the next palace video until the next drop list video until the next streetwear talking uh video in general guys i'll catch you later